Ladies and gentlemen, one and all, welcome to Total War Warhammer 2, the Vlad von Karstein campaign once again. When we last left off, um... Well, we're holding against the Orcs. We have lost, I believe, one territory. Somewhere over here. Yes, we lost Fort Dracova. Uh, to these idiots. But, well, let's face it, but... We don't actually have the full territory yet, so it's not really that much of an issue. Um, also, I kind of noticed as I was loading in, we are um, we are three turns from chaos spawning in, so that's going to be interesting. We also have Grimgore Ironhide, who. Um, Looking a little bit exposed, not gonna lie. I mean, my force is very, um, not elite, but, uh, well, he's, uh, probably gonna retreat knowing him. But, we'll see. I say knowing him, knowing the AI. But, um, we also left Isabella over here, because we're silly. So, we should probably move her to somewhere where she can recruit some proper units, and then we can do her quest that I've been meaning to do for about 16 years! Same with Vlad. We need to do his uh, second quest. I'm not actually sure what the... Uh, is it just the battle we need to do? No, we need to recruit a vampire. Well, we can do that, because over here at Castle Drakenhof, we do actually have the building. Uh, that was the wrong one. Do recruit a vampire. Um, unfortunately, I can't afford it, because I've spent all my money, and I'm way over capacity. Of course. Well... Oh well, let's uh, let's go siege this element. Apparently, we can actually win this. Hmm. Let's um, just siege it. Uh, no, that's auto resolve. Uh, continue siege. No. Apparently, that guy is just a tiny bit too far out of range. Let's go right next to him for his life. And that is probably not an auto resolve. I'm not gonna lie. That's probably um. Okay, what have I got in terms of flying? I've got a terror. Uh, I've got hurt terror guys, two var guys, and that's it. So those rob uh, rock lobbers are probably going to be a bit of a pain in the ass. Oh well. I take it Lightning Strike is not going to do anything here. Uh, that does stop the War Army from coming in. But that also stops my army from coming in. I'm actually tempted to do that, you know? And then we'll just get Og Herds over here to go and uh, smash the other army. You've got a decent army, and you have some pretty damn good magic on your side. Let's, uh, let's quick save it. And then we'll, uh, try a lightning strike for the first time in forever. This can't possibly go wrong. This is where those reinforcements come in anyway, because this is a uh, city battle. Or at least they appear. Yeah, what our armies when you've got lightning strike is not really that much of a concern. I did kind of forget that in the last episode, but yeah. Hopefully, one of those people down by Grimgore has a. Because without the actual host army, the war army just goes blop out of existence. Uh, right, so just mix and uh, mix in some skeletons. Okay. Uh, You two like that. Right. We'll probably just come from this side, to be honest. We could try getting some of their units to spawn over there, but I don't know if it's really worth it in the grand scheme of things. Uh, you're not busy, you're just waiting for orders. 
Uh, I don't think you surpass Nagash. <laughs> no, no, no. You do not surpass Nagash at all. Right. Uh, that is fine. Go. Oh, they decided to... They decided to deploy mostly over there. Alright. Well, we'll uh, charge the gate. Unless, uh, if you'd be so kind as to go and destroy the... Uh... The rock lobbers are deployed in that direction. What are you... I mean... Uh, I'm not even going to question it. Um, guys, you missed the wall. <laughs> Morons. My terror guy seems confused. Smack. And down you go. Oh, those, uh... Yeah, those well guys are getting very, very injured. Hmm. There's not really much you're going to be able to do because of those uh, bloody spider riders. We should still be alright, though. We have fought worse. Let's put it that way. Uh. Wind of death, I suppose. Nah, yeah, they're moving away, so. Go get the rock lobbers. Ladders have docked the walls. How's Vlad and the, uh, his friend doing? Uh, yeah, they've nearly broken the gate. That's, uh, that's useful. Right, if you could please, uh, make a point of Vita Pajuna. Where are you going? Can you not just fly over the... Yeah, the rest of them flew over the buildings. Why can't you? Uh, oh, no, they... What, what do they have? I can't see. I think they've got spears. Yeah, well, good luck with that. Uh, is the gate open? The gate is open. In you go. Go over here. Uh, well, have an orc stew. Two, one. Wee splat. Oi, don't just phase through the terrain. It's to bounce off it. Eh, uh, oh well. I probably made that mistake before. Eh. Where's my, uh, how's my terror guys doing? Yeah, they pretty much cleared up that area over there. Let's not engage the Snotling pub wagons. Let's avoid that if necessary. Or, if we can. Where are you lot going? That might be the perfect opportunity for a, uh, a purple sun. I think they're pulling back to defend the... Uh, Center. Three, two, one. Pop. Bye bye. Now you see the pickens. Now you don't. Yeah, those archers are very, um, very dead. Vlad, uh, you go and. Uh, Actually, no. You deal with the Black Orcs. Vargulf, you go deal with the Archers. Because Vlad is more than capable of dealing with these idiots. I wonder what his, uh, what his stats are at this point. Um, not, not utter ridiculous, but still a little bit silly. With the blood, you can't actually see what's going on. See, there should be an option for like a little bit of blood, but not too much. If it looks like they've just all been sort of thrown a, like a jar of jam or something, then uh, it kind of defeats the object of the uh, 
Okay, maybe it doesn't defeat the object, but it is definitely just annoying. Uh, off walls. Go break everything you can. And if you would please all get a uh, sort of like bunch up there. Vlad can cast an invocation of neck on you. So we hopefully don't have to replenish for quite as long. What are you firing at? Oh, there's some retreating people there. Interesting. Didn't know that. I did not get any of my uh, things back. That's unfortunate. My Vargeists. Do they have any ranged units? They don't appear to. Did the Wolf Riders get out? I think they might have, actually. Vlad. Ah, so there's the Vargeist. Yes, it, uh, the uh, Wolf Riders are gone. No, those are Night Goblins. There's a... Hmm. Let's see if we can chase off the battlefield. I don't know. It's, it seems... They've vanished into the ether. Uh, yeah, good luck with that. Form up. And form up. Oh, he's charging, he's charging, he's charging. Right, counter charge, counter charge. Yes, yeah, good enough. Bonk! I think I did more damage to my own units. Sounds about right with me. Fire! Fire the milkshake! There, eh, a little damage, I suppose. It's not in pump wagons. Stop that charge! Yes. Uh, okay, it didn't actually work, but it's great. What on earth? What happened over there? I think foot of Gork or something. Or maybe that's um, other ability that I don't remember the name of. Where's Vlad, by the way? Oh, you're in the middle. Excellent. That's where you should be. They have activated War, but honestly, I don't think we. I don't think they're going to win here. Dance Picabra. So we now have uh, plus 24 melee attack. Just to uh, attempt to match theirs. Though orcs are still orcs. And they always will be. Though it looks like they're all. Yep. Army loss has kicked in and they're all routing. Perfect. Alright. I probably could have invocationed and uh, cheese that a little bit, but... Uh, details. Right, they're all dead, war army's disbanded, and we have Kislev. Okay, we're going to sack Kislev, and then we're going to have Kislev. Perfect. And you, you're in march stance, but you can probably chase off them, to be honest. Yeah, you can chase them off quite easily. Pyrrhic victory, you say? Ready? Well, I'll take it. I suppose. Alright, sliding that way. Prague is in the hands of Grimgore. God, he really has got his, uh, his tendrils in, hasn't he? And yes, I know Grimgore doesn't have, doesn't have tendrils. I couldn't think of another word at the time. All right, let's. Uh, so, how am I going to do this? 
I think I'm just going to have to let him retreat. Interesting. Okay. You move there. Ooh, I can't get close enough to attack. I might have to let him escape, or just not bring in an Ica. Do we have any good magic? We don't. Although, he's not got that good an army. All things considered, anyway. Got some squeak hoppers, but... Oh yeah, some Ickit is just sort of wandering through our territory. Right, uh, Isabella, if you would please move to the same province where... That's Reichland, that's the one. Now then, we want to recruit units and we want some Grave Guard. Let's get rid of the zombies. Get a load of Grave Guard. Get a load of Grave Guard and. Can you raise. Yeah, there's not any good raised dead there. They are on cooldown. Ooh, we got a Grave Guard. Charge defense against. all. You know, I might stick him in uh, Vlad's army. Anti large uh, dire wolves, eh? Well, let's certainly take those. What are you good with, Isabella? You have a sort of spectrum to Vargeists, so yeah, we'll give you the Vargeists um, regiment of renown, and we'll give you. In fact. Give you more Vargeists. Six should be enough, right? Then we'll just raise a uh, skeleton or something. Right, so two turns from now, you'll be ready for your quest battle. Uh, Vlad has apparently got a, uh, a couple of points, to say the least. Um, Harm. No point in devastating charge, really. I mean, his charge bonus is okay, but I feel his do he does more damage in melee than he does anything else. Some more armor would be nice. Also, more hit points, maybe. Some melee defense. I mean, he is. I am kind of using him as a uh, just throwing into an army and keep them. Uh, like a horde of melee units and just keep them uh, busy. So yeah, I think I think we'll go blade shield. Screw it. Yes. You have a load of level ups. Now the car is noble blood. I mean, I don't see why we wouldn't. I don't really have any of the spells it affects, but screw it, it works. Uh, we'll get wind of death on you. And on you, we'll get a hard to hit. Oh, actually, heroic killing blow is unlocked. We'll uh, get that as well. We'll get that instead, should I say. Uh, Melissa's leveled up. You don't really have much left to uh, to get, to be honest. Master of the Dead. You're a necromancer, but you're our campaign necromancer, I think. Yes, you are. You failed to steal technology from the orcs. Although, let's face it, it's the orcs. What kind of technology do they really have in the grand scheme of things? And that's the second time I've said that in this episode. Uh, that's just an auto-resolve. Goodbye. Right, we have Eastern Sylvania. Everything dies. Everything dies, does it? Right. You're nearly ready. 
Okay, let's tr let's see what uh, Grimgore. Oh God. Okay, that's a pretty um. That's a pretty beefy army. I'm not gonna lie. Um. Undead control large army. No, that uh, is not affected in the slightest. <sighs> We need Vlad over here. He's got both his. Well, I think the um, the AI get their um, their uniques as soon as they unlock them. What is it that's doing all the damage? I mean, Grimgore is actually technically weaker than Vlad is at the moment. I think. I mean, with War, he'll be more, and he's in March stance. Hmm. I get the feeling this is going to be easier than the game actually that's on. I mean, I, oh, I do have a load of zombies, though. Like most of my army is just meat. Eh. Oh, what the hell? How did you... How did you lose that? And he barely lost anything. No, no, no save's coming. We are not... I say we're not. Apparently the game doesn't think we are going to either. Uh, well, doesn't think we're going to save scum. Maybe we'll just let Grimgore retreat. Thank you. Um. Yes, we'll load it. You will, you will lose un all unsafe progress. That's kind of the idea. Oh well. I have to wait about 15 years for it to load. Right. Retreat. <laughs> yeah, retreat. I'm hoping he doesn't have lightning strike. I feel he might do, though. But, I do have three armies here, so if he does attack one, then he attacks all of them. In theory. Obviously, like I said, lightning strike is a... Uh, is a thing. You failed to do your job, Orca, you silly person. I don't know. He's a skeleton. You can't think, he's got no brain. Huh. Might have to. I'll probably send Old Hurt up to Prague. And send Vlad down this way towards Grimgore's main army. Though, like I said, we've got a few uh, issues soon in terms of um, chaos. I mean, Manfred could probably take Grimgore as well. He's got a... Actually, no, he probably couldn't, you know. He's going to need some assistance. Uh, I thought... Oh, you've not got Undying Horde at all, so you might as well take it, to be honest. The extra replenishment. Commandment is available over at Castle Drakenhof. I mean, with that kind of income... There's only one thing we can really choose, and that's tax raid. Gisorix uh, can be upgraded. I mean, I'll do it, why not? Waldenhof can be upgraded. Probably because I just took it back. Uh, probably get a gibbet and some walls there. You can be upgraded. You are damaged. Well, we can't afford that, so we'll do it next turn. We can, however, get resources. Yes, I know, damage building. 
shut up. Oh, I forgot about ghost again. <laughs> that seems to be a common theme in this uh, in this playthrough. I forgot about. In fact, I forgot about all my heroes. Now, what's Grimgore gonna do? I mean, he could just veer off and go for Swartz off, and in which case he would pretty much screw himself over. Oh, he's attacking Grenstad with four armies are surrounding him. What is he doing? Okay, it's a Pyrrhic victory, but I didn't lose... Okay, I lost a Skeleton. Like a Skeleton Spearman I can easily replace. I lost two Skeleton Spearmen. I lost a Zombie, which is like no skin off my nose whatsoever. Are you mad? You, you just... <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, I knew this was... um. This is normal level AI, but that's just... That's just silly. Even by... Even by AI stand... Oh, sort of, Beastmen. What have I ever done to you? Ah, uh, fine. We'll try and fight it, but... Uh... Uh, I don't. I don't see we're going to uh, manage this. To be honest, I mean we don't have any sort of commander whatsoever. <laughs> I mean our commander is technically Cripgulls, a Cripgul whose name is Reynold Regak. Apparently, uh, I'm guessing. Yeah, we can't forward deploy because uh, we don't have Vlad with us. Unfortunate. Well, let's. We'll stick some zombies there, stick some crit ghouls behind here, stick the uh, spearmen next to the zombies, I guess. I can't actually see the zombies, mind you. I swear there's a key to toggle foliage, but I can't remember what it is. And I'm too lazy to look it up. Now, my biggest concern is the minotaurs. But honestly, I think we can take them. I can't remember how much armor they have. In fact, they're there. Let's have a look. See, thirty-five. No forest penalty. Obviously, they're beastmen. I think. I think generally they have no forest penalty. Like, well, yeah, with the large, the large units. They are armor piercing though. Though we don't have anything armoured, so that's not really going to avail them much. Making them less efficient against poorly armoured targets. Well, these guys are actually pretty poorly armoured. I could probably just swarm them with crypt ghouls. Mm. We'll see. Let's just start the battle and. Uh... Where are they going? Now, these guys are pretty fast, Beastmen, so we kind of want to, you know, make sure they don't go causing any major issues for us by, uh... Gone into the trees. Send the bats out to scout. Oh, 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 they're coming in that way, they're coming in that way. Where are their gores? Oh, Ungor Raiders, sorry. Same difference, isn't it? I mean, they have Stork, but now we've discovered them. Won't they stay... Um, 
discovered? I don't know. I think so. No, they won't. They'll fade again after a while. You know what? Let's, uh... Hmm, where are they gone? I wonder if it's worth trying to get on that hill. Are they going to let me? Move back slightly. They don't seem to be... They seem to be waiting for us to come to them. And sadly, there's not really much we can do about that. I think our lack of mobility is going to be our main uh, issue here. Right. They're going that way. Right, raiders are there. Chaos Warhounds are going around. Honestly, I don't really care about that. Okay. Ungols are coming in. Back off from the Minotaurs. Oh, I left it too late. Oh well. Uh, Crypt Ghouls, a few bits of kind. Let's go and break them. Uh, they're poorly armoured as well. Bats, please go kill the Ungol Raiders. I have sent my wolves in as well by accident, because I'm silly. Yeah, we're not going to win this one. Not a chance. The AI probably would have done better, to be honest. Bonk em. Bonk em with your sticks. With your poison sticks. Ow. Yeah, there seems to be... Oh, we just got a Minotaur. Well done. I wish there was, was a slower camera or something. Like a way to slow down the camera without going into the options menu every time. Uh, Felbats. Again, go after the Ungol Raiders. Uh, those zombies are getting mulched, sadly. Uh, I think some of the spearmen broke off. Where, where, where did they go? Apparently they were over here. Why were they over here? Okay, it looks like we're going to... Okay, I don't remember the dial. What's going on here? <laughs> is the AI, Has the AI taken control or something? Because my units seem to be going all over the place. Uh, Alright, they died. We might actually do some pretty decent damage to them. I don't think we're going to win. I mean, well, I know we're not going to win. But we're going to do some proper damage. Right, go off that spearman. Where are my wolves? Okay. Get the wolves out. Oh, spearman nerd's coming back. <laughs> Make them regret it. Nom! Yep, they're immediately... They've immediately uh, routed. Okay. Uh, my units are rallying slightly. But their speed is still... Oh god, here comes the Minotaurs again. Stop them. Cryptoras, go after them. Crypt Ghouls, go after them. Uh, yeah, these guys aren't going to last, I don't think. They're not going to survive. Minotaurs are gone, nearly. Yep, they're fleeing. Right. Ignore, ignore the Lord. And, um, yeah, just sort of... Let's put our Lord... Well, our, I say Lord. Lord... I'm using the term loosely. Spearman herd's gone. 
Yeah, we're gonna do some pretty damn good damage. You're losing ground. No, I'm not. I'm fine. We just got losing a few units to crumbling. Doesn't matter. With the vampire counts, we'll just sort this out. Uh, just race some more or something. Yeah, those Chaos Warhounds are actually doing some pretty, pretty good damage to me, which is really annoying. Uh, yeah, you've been flanked. Best, uh, best not stand there. Go help the uh, things, Cryptors. What's fighting here? Skeleton spearmen. Uh, those crypt are bit just going to crumble, aren't they? Horrors out. Let the wolves come in. Bonk. How Crypt Horrors are losing to Ungor Raiders, I don't know. I guess because of the grumbling. Yeah. This is the issue with uh, Beastmen. They just sort of outmaneuver you. Ah, there goes my army. Yep. And there we all go. I'd say that was Valiant Defeat at the least. Yeah, I was going to say, that's Valiant Defeat. They gave up a lot. Shadow Gore Warhead. My concern is that they're now, they're now going to go for um, Leonka's former territory. Or former headquarters. So why are you... Ambush are discovered, you don't say. Alright. So yeah, Grimgore is now... Um, well, not exactly deceased, but he is, um, he is gone for the moment. Uh, can I just... They don't want a peace treaty, apparently. Despite the fact that I severely outnumber them. Okay. That's, uh... We got another Von Karstein there. Uh, you are wounded. Uh, you I have apparently recruited four, so... Or it could be that she just, you know... Um... Yeah, it could be that she's just uh, she was recruited by Vlad uh, Manfred and then uh, has transferred across. How good are the Corone's defenses? Uh, uh, not good at all. The Minotaur survived. Damn it! How good Castle Artois' defenses? A little bit better, but still not great. Though I think it should be enough to defeat them because we've got turrets as well. Or towers. Gizorix is a little bit exposed. Alright. Uh, Krak, what are you going to be... Uh, I suppose we'll give you evasion so you can go up to uh, your other abilities. Ah, that was Bernard. Okay. Right, let's... Get you right to the edge. And Anika, you can uh, you can follow. I think we're gonna have to send Deirdrick up this way to try and help fight Chaos later on. You really not get to Naganov. Uh Will I suffer attrition in this territory? It doesn't look yet. Let's find out. <laughs> this is where we start suffering attrition. No, we're not. Follow me. Bats and wolves gather. Uh, well, it seems like Grimgore's gone for a minute. Let's go to Prague. Oh. 
What do you mean preposterous? What did I say? I don't really want that, to be honest. We'll probably let um, old troll person over there, I can't remember his name, take it. Assuming he can take it. He is Norska, so I don't actually know if he can. We'll raise it. At least that way, it's not a uh, not a major issue. He's going to take one turn of attrition, but I think we can survive. And we go grab Vortkova, and then that will be uh, Grimgore pushed out of this area. Well, not only Grimgore, but uh, the Red Eyes as well. Is it Red Eyes? Yeah, Red Eye. There's Wurzag. We do need to be careful for him. He's still got a full stack. That's their war target. Let's go have a look. They are... They are besieging it, and they do have enough of an uh, army that they probably take it. It's unfortunate. I kind of want to, wanted them to sort of fail that. Right, what other objectives? I've got four of the eight settlements I need. So I need Oak of Ages, I need Help It. Actually, uh, Vlad could head up in that direction. I mean, I wasn't planning it originally, and Help It's going to have some pretty well, hellish defences. Oh, I should have taken Prague. That could have been a good staging area. Oh, well. Uh, Karazakarak. That's over there. So we could send that army round to Karazakarak. Karak Eight Peaks. That's over there. Could send the army there afterwards. Black Crag is pretty much next door. We could win this campaign in the next couple of videos. At least... For a short thing, anyway. A uh, short campaign victory. I'm not going long campaign victory. This, this has gone on long enough. Uh, okay. Vulka, if you'd be so kind as to uh, make your way up here and wound him, if possible. Probably not. Uh, you head in this direction because we're going to need you for help it, I think. That is Isabella's quest. You are... What could you do? I mean, we'll probably send you with... Oh, yes, because of the because we smashed Grimgore, we get more nice things. Alright, let's get rid of some of the zombies and recruit. I can recruit six Crypt Ghouls at least. One. Oh, he's already got like loads of Crypt Ghouls. Okay. In that case, we'll probably just give you skeletons. Can you give you a couple of Black, Knight, uh, uh, Black Knights with barding, lances and barding? Give you a couple of grave guard. Well, let's get rid of two of you. Uh, actually, let's just merge you. See if we lose any. Uh, yeah. There we go. So, you are now. Yeah, you can't get through. It's like a conga line of vampire counts. Everybody conga. Etc. Etc. Okay. Are you going to manage it this time? No, you're not, because we can't afford it. Damage building. Oh, I forgot to restore Gislev. Okay. 
Ferdinand von Schwarzhofen. You're the one that died a little while ago, didn't you? Uh, well, you can go and have a look at help it for me. Speaking of help it, where is uh, old Wass's face? Whose name I keep forgetting. <sighs> Hmm. Not really much else useful, uh, not much in the way of useful things that we can go for with uh, Melissa now. She's basically reached full, uh, full what's it called anyway. Oh god damn it, Manfred. Well, I say, damn it, man for it, and I just forgot about him. But Clan Mulder is very weak. Grimgore still got half his strength list, though. <laughs> they tried to they tried to assassinate Volker, and um, managed to get themselves assassinated. What a bumbling fool! Uh, Throg, what are you doing? Oh dear God, that's. Okay, um, we're, we're running low on income. We may have over, um, we may have over purchased troops. Uh, okay, go get um, the Angui. Uh, yep, you die. How the? How did you lose that many? You suck at this. Right, colonize that. Okay. Once again, set that to. Uh, let's set it to. There's not much point going for the um, tax rate, really, is there? Let's just go for foster terror, I guess. Right, we're going to need to uh, disband an army, probably. Uh, it's Bella. You can do your um, your quest battle now. I need money to teleport her, don't I? Needs five hundred. Okay. Go have a look at help it, please. Actually, that's that's above ground. Well, go see what the actual defences are. There's no units. There's no people here. Oh, they have really screwed up. Although, I need to replenish first. Yeah, I need to replenish first. Uh, well, I'm going to win a battle over here, so that should be enough to... Uh... Yeah, we'll win that. Something, something, go for confidence. Nope, nope, we won. And occupy... I have completed Southern Oblast, apparently. Or however the bloody hell you pronounce it. So how much is uh, Drachenhof producing now? Eh, even with tax rate up, it's still not uh, producing as much as I had hoped. I'm guessing the tax income isn't actually that great. No. No, it's not. Okay, well, we'll, uh, shut up. We'll manage, I'm sure. Get put on more pendulum as well, because they're beast men. Right, let's teleport over to your, um, your quest. Like, sadly cannot, um, actually, you know, Auto resolve this because it's a quest battle. On this occasion, the fury of the beast men is unmatched, as is their strength. Isabella and her forces must pick their adversaries carefully. Something, something, something. There is such a 
Such wonder in the raw, unbridled fury of these beast men. They teem and fester with might. I might find them beautiful if they weren't so terribly disgusting. Yet they have attracted the attention of the ignorant empire. Clearly, they possess some power beyond that of their brutish ilk. Indeed. Whatever this power is, I shall have it. And I shall use it to ascend the Von Karsteins to ever greater magnificence. Okay. Well. Let's see what shenanigans we can get up to, shall we? Now, I said pick battles carefully. Does that mean we're going to get... Um... Oh, I can... Uh... Right. Um... Yeah, does that mean we're going to get a rather... Um... Shall we say... Problematic encounter happen occasionally? I get the feeling we're going to get yeah, we're gonna get ambushed. There's a there's a way there, there's a beast path there, there's a beast path there. It looks like there's some behind there as well. We're gonna get ambushed, I know for a fact. I wonder if it's worth just sending one unit forward and then seeing what uh, what happens. What spells do you have? Not much Champion is his friend, he's heard of beast is a blood hungry gorbal. Kill him before he tears his apart. Mm, I do not trust this. We are gonna get ambushed. This is beast men we're talking about here. That's what they specialize at. Although I didn't see any reinforcements on the, um, the first screen. Doesn't necessarily mean they're not going to have any, though, I don't think. This is a quest battle, after all. Hmm. Send Isabella up to the statue. Probably cast Wind of Death from... Nah, your Wind of Death range is quite small. They have an interesting... Um, I wonder how good Wind of Death will be against minor tools. Probably not very. Uh, Isabella, you really need a mount. I assume she can get a mount. I don't know. Well, we've not been ambushed. There has to be a trick to this. Probably don't even know of Carl's version, to be honest. So where's that Gorble? He's there. Well, they're dead. Ah, oh, I just skimmed it. Oh, come on. <laughs> I fluffed that one royally. Well, it's a little bit of damage at least. Let's move forward.
I get the feeling I'm getting screamed at off screen. The longer you stay here, the sooner they'll attack you. Oh, oh they're, they're moving, they're moving, they're moving. They are most definitely moving. Oh, what the hell is that? Okay, they just used some sort of magic on me. That's nice of them. Oh, yeah, hidden foes. I should have expected that, really. Alright. Uh, okay, you go on three and go down there. You guys. Uh, that is Bella. Use a wind to death there, please. Hopefully they don't move. They moved. God damn it. We glanced them. Where are the monitors? There they are. We appear to be suffering heavy casualties. This is kind of annoying. Around. Oh, I'm sorry. Were you trying to get in on the, uh, like the sort of in a charge or something? That's uh, sadly for you. That's not going to uh, happen. This is a Bella. I don't know where she is, but well, we'll uh, we'll just send her in anyway. Careful that gore herd. What is that ability? The Empire and Jaws. The Empire and Jaws. You realize you're fighting for the vampire counts, right? Quickly. I was like overly cautious on this battle. I may very well have been. At least the uh, at least the fact that my crypt is getting wiped out will actually. Uh, oh, that's the um, that's the gorbel I want to kill, isn't it? And they're getting minor Uh Guys, can you go and help the? Uh... Okay, stop, talk, get off skirmish mode. Move up there and let the uh, vargeists come in to help. Hmm, I'm a little concerned about that. Uh... Gorbal, but he doesn't seem to be doing too, too much. Well, guys, probably going to end up doing a decent amount of damage. All things considered. I can actually add it effect area. Oh, yeah. You have to actually still cast up a single point, though. Screw it, use the scroll of power. Kill it. Okay, that was actually a lot easier than I was making it out to be. I was expecting, like, to be close victory. I lost a few crypt goals. We can replenish them, it's fine. Besides, I need the income. Quest complete. Mm. Kind of need the money. I'll take the money. Huzzah! We now have the blood chalice. And now we need to recruit a necromancer. What? Why? Why have you reissued the. Confused. 
Do I have it now? It doesn't look like it. No. Because I need to recruit a necromancer, apparently. Um, okay. There we go. This is a very long question, I get the feeling. Uh, let's... Can I not... Oh, I can't get rid of him now. Oh. Okay. Hmm. You can't... You really can't attack that. Why can you not attack that? Your movement... Why is your movement range... Like, terrible? Can you reach it? You can't. Throg, get out of my territory. While I'm here, I'll uh, make the poaching camp and we'll probably repair, repair Kislev. Oh, no, that's uh, we're not going to repair Kislev because that'll drive us into uh, bankruptcy. And all my units will start deteriorating. Which isn't uh, exactly what I would, uh, would want. Alright, I guess then we will call it a day there. So, thank you very much for watching everybody, I hope you have enjoyed it. This will definitely be wrapping up soon. I get the feeling we might actually be able to get all the way to a campaign victory, but we shall see. And until next time, I have been Kaldaris. Goodbye.